One piece of business when you come back in September. What about gun legislation? We've been talking about this uh, more so recently, obviously, after these three deadly shootings. What do you want to see, Senator? Well, I, the president's more determined than ever to get something done that makes sense. We're not going to take people's guns away from them. I own an AR-15. I lawfully own a gun. If you took my gun away, the bad guys are not going to give up their guns. It's the person with the gun that I'm focused on. We want to keep guns out of the hands of dangerous people who are hateful or mentally ill. Uh, the red flag legislation grants to states that have these red flag laws. The president's focused on that. Working with uh, Senator Manchin, we can maybe enhance background checks. The guy in Philadelphia had been convicted like six or eight times. How the hell did he get a gun to begin with? The guy in El Paso was one of these white supremacist hate sites where they radicalize each other. We should shut those sites down. The guy in Dayton was kicked out of school because he had a rape list, a kill list. He was clearly violent. Why did that guy get a gun to begin with? So we're looking at protective order legislation, red flag legislation, grant programs to help states to hire mental health professionals for the cops to evaluate what cases to go to court, plenty of due process, and do something on background checks. I hope we act. I believe the president's going to lead us uh, to a solution this time. You know. We